Well, first and foremost, anything to do with double tax treaties. Uh, within that large topic, I'm particularly interested in the PE definition in Article 5, and in particular, the at the disposal test in Article 5 1. Uh, the undefined terms provision, Article 3 2, and its relationship with the commentaries to the OECD and UN model treaties. The other income article, Article 21, particularly Paragraph 3 of Article 21 in the UN model treaty, which can be dangerous in the hands of an aggressive tax authority. Uh, the non-discrimination article, Article 24, uh, the principal purposes test, the PPT in Article 29, and, and the interaction between double tax treaties and domestic law rules, including treaty override situations, you know, situations in which domestic law overrides the treaty, and also situations in which the treaty can increase the source country tax, which, of course, is a controversial topic. Apart from treaties, I'm, I'm interested in EU tax law, particularly the freedom of establishment and the free movement of capital, and how they can have a significant impact on the corporate income tax laws of member countries, and the application to, to tax rules and rulings of the provision against state aid is also interesting. European Court of Justice cases on anti-avoidance rules and on VAT I would also put on my list. Um, I'm interested in the significant changes which are happening to transfer pricing, the significant changes to TP in the BEPS project and reflected in the current version of the OECD's transfer pricing guidelines. For example, the priority of conduct over, over written contracts and the major changes which might be made in this current digital taxation phase. I'm interested in understanding how the tax laws of other countries work how different countries deal with the same issue in different ways. And I'm generally interested in international tax cases from around the world, seeing the disputes which arise in different countries, the arguments which are put, the decisions which are made. We can learn a great deal from studying tax cases from other countries. So that's a fairly long list. Did I leave anything out? <laughs>